just got to love the rocket um, barbecue. It's just brilliant. Got some lovely organic um, lamb chops there. And here I've just done some lamb ribs. Beautiful, absolutely beautiful. So easy to start. There it is going. I've got, got some cypress in there at the moment, which is quite an oily uh, timber from northern Australia. Um, so it really crackles and cackles a bit. But uh, that's just sucking the air straight in there and going straight up that chute. So uh, it's a pretty simple uh, contraption. You don't need that concrete. I just did that for an experiment for retention of heat, but you don't need it for this application of barbecue. Um, putting some fiberglass insulation around there would uh, is a real benefit. Um, Underneath here, I've just got a few screws to enable uh, a bit of a um, outlet for the heater. As you can see, there's just no smoke at all, at all. The only smoke that there is is coming off these beauties, which you might just be able to see. There you go. Beautiful. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoy these videos. That's certainly up to temperature. It took me about. Uh, two or three minutes to get it um, the fire going. Just, um, I found the best way to get the fire going is actually put um, take the top off when you clean the top and throw bits of um, newspaper, wrapped up newspaper, just down the chimney and keep on throwing it in as it can take it, not to clog it up. Generate starts generating a lot of heat. Get a few of these sticks here and whack them down and they just catch on fire then. And leave it in for uh, a couple of minutes. You can pretty much whack the top straight back on and just start generating heat. So you could have the barbie ready within about three or four minutes. Um, so it's really not an issue to start so easy and then just start feeding the wood in from here. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoy my videos.